All right, so here we are, July 10th, 2008, County, New Hampshire. Beautiful day, a little overcast, probably about 80 degrees out. And this is going to be a demonstration of how to properly splint a fractured pelvis. All right, so Ivan's going to start with a patient, quick patient exam for us. He's going to work from the head down. So he's just checking the head real quick. Everything's nice and stable, the neck is stable. He's checking his clavicles and the shoulders, doing great. Chest is nice and stable. Belly's nice and soft. Excellent. Gets down the pelvis. He squeezed the pelvis and it shifted. He closed. So it was an open book fracture and it's now closed. So now Ivan's going to hold that tight while Sean okay. comes in. So Ivan, I'm going to have you hold the pelvis stable. We're going to get a couple more people to come in okay. and we're going to lift him off the ground so we can slide this pad underneath in order to stabilize that pelvis. Okay. So Dana, if you get in on the torso here, Sarah right here. Mimi, I'm going to have you come in on this side right here, and then I'll take this side over here. Okay, so Jerry, I'm just going to lift your arm up and put it on this pad right here so we're ready to move it, okay? Ivan, since you're the one stabilizing the hips, we're going to go on your count, okay? Ready? Anybody, not, anybody ready? All ready. Okay, yep. one, two, three. Straight up, perfect, okay? I'm going to slide this pad right under, okay? One, two, three. Okay. Excellent. The whole time I've been holding that pelvis closed for us. Okay, I'm just going to kind of bring your arm up to the side there for a minute here. Perfect. So we're going to wrap this pad right up around the pelvis here. Slide those hands right out and hold them. Perfect, Ivan. Okay. So now we're going to use some cravats to tie that in place and keep that stabilization. So I'm just going to take this. Dana, I'm going to pass it to you under the small of his back here. Okay. Got it there? Yeah. I'm going to get my hand out. Okay. Go ahead and slide that through once you get it. Perfect. Okay. Now we'll take this and kind of bring it down a little further. Okay. So we're down at the bottom with that one. Do the same thing with this one here. Pass it into the small of his back to you again. Okay. Got it? Mm -hmm. Pull that one right through. Okay. Slide that down a little bit. And we'll do one more. Okay. I hand that over there if I can. Ivan's hand is there. Seesaw action, bring it down. There we go. Okay, kind of slide your hand right out over it, Ivan. Perfect. Okay, same thing. Thumb there for me. Yeah, let me do one more wrap here. There we go. Okay, thumb on it for me. Perfect. And then one more right here. Okay. Excellent. So, Ivan, you feel like they've taken the tension from your hands? Yes. That splint has replaced your hands? Yes, sir. Excellent. So, this is just a simple example of a gentleman who was fallen, had a fractured pelvis, closed the pelvis, held it still, and while he did, they just simply using an end slide pad wrapped that around a couple of cravat ties to tie it in place. Jerry, are you comfortable? Yes. Excellent. All right. Yay! Thank you, team. <laughs> <laughs>